Devontae Mitchell is laid to rest today. The 43-year-old black man died after entering a Hyatt Regency hotel in Milwaukee. Hotel security guards detained him after what his mother called a mental health episode. Roxana Saberi talks with civil rights attorney Ben Crump and Mitchell's sister who are calling for justice. But we will warn you before we play the video, some viewers may find the footage disturbing. Stay down! Please stop fighting! Witness cell phone video shows multiple Hyatt Regency Hotel personnel pinning down Devonte Mitchell with their hands and knees as the 43-year-old appears to beg for help. Stay down! With his chest, stomach, and face pressed to the ground, Mitchell repeatedly apologizes and pleads with them. This is what happens when you go into the ladies' room. First responders found Mitchell unresponsive when they arrived at the scene. He was later pronounced dead. Milwaukee police say the incident started when Mitchell entered the hotel, caused a disturbance, and fought with the security guards as they escorted him out. I couldn't take it, you know what I mean? Like, watching it, hearing his voice, hearing him yell for help, begging him to stop. It's just heartbreaking. Mitchell's sister, Naisha, and other family members say the father of two was suffering from mental health issues. They could have let him go, and they didn't. Hyatt is now calling for the employees who worked for hotel operator Ambridge Hospitality to face criminal charges. The Milwaukee County DA's office says it's awaiting a full autopsy, but is reviewing the case as a potential homicide. And when people are struggling to breathe, you don't keep them in a prone position with weight on them. What would justice look like to you? I need charges brought. I need somebody to be arrested. Roxana Saberi, CBS News, in Milwaukee. Hyatt announced today that several employees involved in this situation have been fired, saying their actions violated company policies and procedures. It is unclear why Mitchell was at the hotel or what happened before the guards pinned him down.